Hey Morning Star, Justin Perry here. We are days away from Resurrection Sunday. Of course, this is the time during Passover whenever we remember the incredible eternity and history changing event that happened whenever Jesus hung on the cross, received the wrath of God for our sins, was buried, and on the third day rose again in victory, conquering over sin, conquering over Satan, being raised on our behalf so that we can receive his righteousness and be made right with God. And so this is a major, major significant time uh, for Christians, also for Hebrews as they uh, remember this time of Passover. So we want to celebrate, and we have got an incredible, incredible time planned together on Sunday to celebrate. We've got an incredible uh, time of worship where we're going to be just, just really glorifying Jesus and lifting him up. We have some of the most powerful testimonies that you've ever heard that are going to be shared, some of the incredible uh, testimony of what God has done in the lives of some of the amazing people that are in our church. I also have a message that I'm going to be preaching. Uh, we're going to be having communion together. It's just going to be an awesome, awesome time in the presence of God. Uh, so join us on Sunday, Resurrection Day. Uh, and I also want to uh, just be sure that you know that we will not have School of the Spirit on Friday. Friday is Good Friday, and so uh, our staff is off, and we're not going to be having that service, but we will be together on Sunday. Uh, bring the lost. Bring people you know who don't know the Lord. Invite your neighbors. Invite family members. They will hear the gospel. They'll have an opportunity to respond. And we're also having a baptism on April 8th. This is next Sunday. So if you need to be baptized, if your kids need to be baptized, uh, if there's someone you know who needs to be baptized, you know, you could even uh, let family or friends know, you know, we're doing a baptism uh, next week. Have you ever considered giving your life to Jesus? You know, would you like to be a part of this baptism? And it could be a great opportunity to lead them to the Lord. I am, I'm praying into harvest. I know that you are. I have been for many, many years. We have a promise that the harvest is the end of the age. And we have specific promises for our region, for the Charlotte area. Many, many prophetic promises that God is going to bring in the, the multitudes into the kingdom in a massive harvest. And so let's pray into it. Let's worship together on Sunday. Let's get ready for a powerful time of baptism during our worship service on April 8th, next Sunday. And I look forward to seeing you there at Morningstar.